Hi, my name is Suet. I'm one of the hand therapists in Morristown. I want to show you today how to make a metal finger splints. I know there's so many designs. People like to make like a circumferential or they make like a uh, like a stack splints. The one I like to make is this one. Okay, it's very easy to make. Just take you like about five minutes. So first you cut a piece of swinging material. So about something like this, and then you kind of put it like the fingers and really closer so about that long so you make sure it's about the pap joint and cover the whole finger and then you're going to be cut like a slit so when you cut it make sure just below the dip joint okay all right because you want to cover the whole thing one of the good thing about this pattern you can even make the uh, the tip of the finger a uh, little more hyper extension which is what you want to do so i'm putting hot water first So, once it gets nice and soft, all right, so I'm going to cut like a slit right there, just nice and easy. All right, and then you're going to stretch a little bit more. So I'll put it back in the hot water. that's good yeah so you can open up like a mega hole okay all right now when I usually make it I usually turn I have people turn it this way so kind of you can even like make it a little more happy extension so all right so what you're going to do is that <clears throat> you can just go through the hole okay all right and then that's very easy. You just gonna do it like this, like that. So you kind of keep it, keep molding it, and put a little more hyperextension in the DIP joint. It's just very easy to make. Just take five minutes. So you keep like about ten degree hyperextension. So keep molding around it. So make sure you want to cover the DIP joint. Okay, all right. So let it set. Just take five minutes. It's so easy to make. Yeah. Even you can have them straight with more, get more hyper extension. Just let it set. That's it. So this is the one I just finished it. It's just to show you the finished product. All right. Slide it in like that. Sometimes I even put like a pad right here, so it will be kind of more snug. So one strap on the top, one strap on the bottom. That's it. Thank you for watching it.